What's good? It's Shigozi. It's Monday, September 21st, 2020. And real quick, just some fake news propaganda. These 63 Bed Bath & Beyond stores are set to close by the end of 2020. That's this article right here. Bed Bath & Beyond equals 63. Bed Bath & Beyond equals 63. They're saying these 63 Bed Bath & Beyond stores. And of course, you know, I noticed the one of the ones in Ohio with the 1170 address. You know, 117, Buckeye 117. All right, Amazon hiring once again, the company looking to recruit. So, that real quick. And then, what else I saw? A man known as Dreadhead Cowboy. A man known as the Dreadhead Cowboy was arrested for riding his horse on a Chicago highway. Dreadhead Cowboy equals equals 70. And this is happening on it with 70 numerology. 70, Dreadhead Cowboy equals 70. See that? So this is by the numbers. And we read out his real name. What do they call this guy? Adam Hollingsworth. Adam Hollingsworth equals 199, the 46 prime, and Chicago equals 46. This is in Chicago, Illinois. Chicago equals 46, like Adam Hollingsworth. Adam Hollingsworth equals 199, the 46 prime. And the city wrote down the Dan Ryan Expressway in support of Kids Lives Matter. Why is he supporting Kids Lives Matter today? Because Kids Lives Matter also has interesting gematria. Kids Lives Matter equals 101, and this is coming out, what, a day with 101 days remaining. So Dreadhead Cowboy 70, Kids Lives Matter 101, all by the numbers. It also equals 187, like Society of Jesus. So they're saying it was on the Dan Ryan Expressway. Dan Ryan Expressway equals... 227 to 49 prime, 79, the 22nd prime, Negro 22, Society of Jesus 79, Ancient Accepted Scottish, Scottish Rite of Freemasonry equals 227, Dan Ryan equals 32, like Negro. Are they saying that he was on his horse? Horse equals 70. So horse equals 70. The guys are dread. Head Cowboy, 70, riding the horse. So he arrested for riding his horse in the freeway, on the Chicago Highway. 70 numerology. Maybe if I go to yahoo.com, we'll still see the... We'll still see the... There was something about suicide... It was published yesterday, but they put it out today. Man, so it's not here anymore, but that doesn't even matter. We already saw suicide stuff with Lady Gaga, so they're not even done here. This dreadhead cowboy was arrested for riding his horse on the Chicago Highway, right? Kids Lives Matter 79, 79 like Society of Jesus. But there was an... See, it's funny because I already pieced this all together. And... Yeah. I guess I missed the 83. Well, horse 30 at the reflection. Oh, that's why I didn't write it out. Cowboy equals 83. Cowboy equals 83... 79, like Society of Jesus. Cowboy 83, updated at 803. But this is all just warm up. This video, I want to show you a bit more in the Jesuit order. People were wondering about them. Society of Jesus. You just go to Society of Jesus, and I'll just give you a preview at who we've been talking about. The Society of Jesus is a religious order of the Catholic Church headquartered in Rome. 
It was founded by Ignatius de Loyola, who died 84 days from his birthday, and six companions with the approval of Pope Paul III in 1540. And you can see Pope Paul III and how he died ritualistically by the numbers. He died November 10th, 1549, nine years from the foundation of the Jesuits in 1540. Sun equals nine, found in the ninth month. Pope Paul III dies nine months later, or nine years later, excuse me. And this guy was murdered by the Jesuits, all by the numbers. Pope Paul III is nothing else than another actor for the Catholic Church. Literally, it's one of their actors. What, I mean, what do you do? Acted and some Italian agent. Head of the Catholic Church to let you know everything. Sure, you can say, oh, they infiltrated the Catholic Church. Guys, these people have been operating since the foundation. These people have been operating before the Jesuits. So, you know, these people go way further back than them, but they use the Jesuits, right, as the as the, the pinnacle, as the the piece that we really interact with. So it's extremely important. February 29th, 1468. So February 29th, he died when? Pope Paul III died November 10th, 1549. So from then to November 10th, 1549, is oh I see well still we could do March 1st not that it matters time you know 254 time 254 light 254 8 months 9 days Hmm. You wonder how would you do this, you know what I mean? I do see the 8 months 14 days, but I'm not trying to connect with the 84. February 29th, 1550. They probably won't let me do that either. But... 110 days, the February 28th, three months, 19 days. So if you count the end date, that would, you know, in a sense, make up for that February 29th. Three, three months, 19 days from his upcoming birthday, that's a very special number. 319 is the number for 319 killing. The Sonic 319 killing 319. F 15 weeks and six days, 156. When we were at 33, you got 156. So, these people have been ruling Catholicism 112, 112 nations. The Society of Jesus is consecrated under the patronage of Madonna della Strada, a title of the Blessed Virgin Mary. And this Madonna della Strada has important numbers into it, numbers that the Jesuits love to use. So, you want to keep these in mind for other riddles. Madonna della Strada literally does equal 69, like what? The Jesuit Order, 69. Like Catholic Church, 69. And they're all about Mary. Madonna della Strada also equals 159, like Scottish Rite. You know, 111, 327. So, what's Virgin Mary led by a superior general? So Saint Ignatius of Saint Ignatius of Loyola, you can look at his life himself. You don't have to look at the Jesuits. This is a portrait of him. This is very well what this actor looked like, possibly if he even existed. But notice how he died in 1556, born in 1491. The Society of Jesus equals 91, and Society of Jesus equals 56. And you see that 56, 91 with this actor, Ignatius of Loyola. His name equals 201-84, like the Jesuit order. 
Also, I want to start pointing out Ignatius of Loyola equals 87 and 231. It's a 231 I really want to start pointing out because that's the 21st triangular number, Jesuit 21. But when they just straight up call 231, they're also rep referencing this actor, Ignatius of Loyola. This guy's an agent. A Spanish Basque Catholic priest. You have to understand, they don't tell you this, but I've always felt like this guy is one of these Sephardic Jews who founded the Jesuits. I don't care if they don't say it here. Maybe he's you know, born Catholic, but I don't think that matters. Because again, they want you to think that, you know, the Catholics, the Jews, they're separate. They don't like each other. When it couldn't be further from the truth. John Calvin. This guy was murdered by the numbers. Murdered by the, by the Catholic Church. Guarantee you. Jehan Calvin, a French theologian, pastor, and reformer in Geneva during the Protestant Reformation. So him, Martin Luther, these are all the agents around then. And this guy was murdered by the Catholic Church, by the numbers. John Calvin. Notice how his name equals 54. That's a big number for what? The Jesuit order. Jesuit order equals 54, like John Calvin. Calvin equals 10161. <laughs> oh my god, you see how his name equals 10161? John Calvin. Church going against the church 10161. That is why I'm guys, I'm not being funny saying that this is an actor. This is an actor for the Catholic Church. The whole Protestant Reformation was a theatrical play from this one world order. How do I why am I saying that? Because sure, if it was Martin Luther really coming out of nowhere doing things. He wouldn't have his 95 theses, you know, wouldn't be that by the numbers. You wouldn't have John Calvin. Calvin equals the same thing as church. I mean, come on. These are agents for the gang. So John Calvin, born Jehan Calvin. Jehan, I can't even pronounce it, but look at how that equals 108, 45, like John Calvin. They kept the gematria and the English spelling. And Jehan Calvin, 63, also like Jesuit order. 63, 54. It's so clear how these people are doing this by the numbers. It's extremely clear. So this guy died May 27th, 1564 at 54 years old, right? And let's go back to 54, the Jesuits and their actor agents. Who is John Carroll? John Carroll University. And we have Georgetown. We have all this, all this stuff, all these, this Catholic nonsense. But John Carroll, his name equals what? In Ohio as well, you know, I'm not surprised. I want to tell is his name after John Carroll and click on him. But I want to show you how he died at 54 years old and his name equals 54. Like judge would order. John Carroll equals 54. 63 like judge would order. Like John Calvin 54. And you look up the guy, John Carroll. Ran out of this space. Oh no. Uh, just in case we're still recording. I don't know what's going on. Because he's at 54. I'm running out of this space. Let's see how many days this guy died from his birthday. John Calvin. And we'll close it. John Calvin... Maybe it's, I'm not spelling it wrong because it was 54. 
So he died at 54. How many days did he die from from his upcoming 55th birthday? May 27th. 1564 till July 10th, 1564. Your Catholic 71. We're going to do this. We're gonna, literally going to close it because my computer looks, sounds like it's about to crap out. There's no more space left. 45 days. John Calvin, 45. His, his name equals 45, the original name and the new name, both equal 45, dying 45 days from his birthday, span of four, well, it's a span of 45, 44 span of 45, kill 44, execution 44, see, killed 46, sacrifice 62, judge would order 63, see that, six weeks, three days from his birthday, guys, this guy was murdered by the numbers, John Calvin, guys, was murdered by the numbers. If he even existed, could have easily... You have to understand, I mean, back then especially, extremely easy for, for this guy to fake his death. You know, so... Don't believe in this shit, but it doesn't matter. It's all rich.